weather a bit on the cooler side today, and now we're tracking some storms. A live look outside right now. Will the rain crash this weekend's Chicago Marathon? Rob Ellis is in for Mary Kay, and here now with the forecast that really is important, especially this weekend. It really is, and it's going to be waves of rain. So the question now is, will those waves coincide to whatever your plans are? And of course, the marathon. Take a look at the numbers right now. 40s and 50s. We're very close to our low temperature for the night because we expect the numbers to actually warm up over time. Satellite radar, when we look at the bigger picture, yeah, some of those showers and storms down to the south and west, they are moving this way, and that's why we expect that to happen sometime after midnight to at least increase the rain chances, but I think our best chance is not necessarily going to be from this, although it will arrive overnight. I think the best chance is going to be from this next batch of rain, and that's pretty much the pattern that you get over the next several days, really over the next week. You get these showers and storms that come in waves. Now, I'm going to call it cloudy with showers by morning. Most of you will see that at least for your morning commute off and on. I've got a nice round 50 here, but we already saw some 40s. I just think that's pretty much where we are because the numbers likely to warm up overnight or at least hold steady for where they are right now. And you can see by 6 a.m. a lot more coverage showing up on future cast and expected to maybe give us a little bit of a break by midday before picking back up again sometime into the evening. Once we get into the evening, a few more showers and storms could be possible, even a little cluster of storms that we'll have to watch as far as any severe weather. Here's Saturday morning. Again, more scattered showers and storms, and we may do this kind of off and on pattern all the way through Saturday. And yes, even into Sunday for the marathon, we'll have to watch that morning showers and then late evening storms again with a little bit of a break in the middle and the 66. By the way, this comes at the end of the day, so I think our temperatures will be coolest in the morning and then even warm up into the overnight hours as we get into Saturday at 73. Now we'll jump back down to 67 for Sunday, but then we warm it way up. Yes, to 80 degrees for Tuesday for the marathon. I'm calling for 57 with some showers and maybe even a few storms in the morning. Pretty nice temperatures, but I hope we don't have one of those heavy downpours and take a look here. The entire seven day, almost the entire seven day has showers and storms in the forecast, but there's a little bit of something for everyone when it comes to numbers. Yeah, that 80 on Tuesday. Yeah. Mighty nice. Thank mm -hmm. you, Rob. Quick, grab a glass.